Hello, I just finished watching that featured video on today's page. It's entitled Leaving Shelter. It just was such a fantastic, uh, well-made video. You can tell a lot of love and uh, a lot of time was spent in making that particular video. My name is Kathleen and I am an alcoholic. Some of you out there in YouTube land may already know this and you have your own stories and you share very openly and honestly and eloquently with us all. Uh, I presently have well over seven years of sobriety. January 1st, 2008, I will have, God willing, eight years of sobriety. And so the reason why I'm making this video is essentially to, to just uh, touch a little bit upon why that that particular video, Leaving Shelter, tugged at my heartstrings. I never want to forget, 17 years ago, I ended up living in what they term now sober living environment. They also call them halfway houses. Essentially, it was a house, a safe house for women who had drug and alcohol problems to live in. You know, that's how down and out I was. 17 years ago, my parents wanted nothing to do with me. I was like the product prodigal daughter coming home after a five-year bender on the alcohol. I didn't really touch drugs. Alcohol is my drug of choice. I came home. My parents were like sick of me. My 18-year-old, my then 18-year-old brother at the time was really disgusted with me. And really my only alternative was AA and Alcoholics Anonymous gave me that new life and they gave me hope and I lucked out and was able to live in that sober living house for about, I'd say, nine months or so before I branched out and rented, had an apartment with roommates and so on and so forth and my life started to take off at that point. But, you know, unless you actually bottom out and you you hit rock bottom and you find yourself homeless and you live with complete total strangers and they all happen to be women and you know it's just such an, an earth-shattering experience if you've never gone through it yourself um, I find that having been homeless you know that's just like that's the ultimate for me I, I never want to go back there and maybe that's why you know I tend to block that part of my life out so for me today to stand here before you and say that one of my gifts of sobriety is to have a roof over my head and to have successfully been married a full year now and a true blessing for me is the fact that we will be flying over to Italy soon in a few months time maybe as early as November this year I don't know and the fact that they're gonna put us up you know that's a miracle we'll have a roof over our head for two whole years in a foreign country Italy of all places you know that's just to me it just blows my mind it's staggering so I've come a long ways I believe in 17 short years time and for those of you that care to wish please go ahead and do a video response to this particular video and let me know what some of the blessings are in your life and especially if you um, also are sober as well if you'd like to go ahead and leave a video response and let me know what some of the gifts of sobriety are for you in your life that'd be great Thanks a lot. Have a good day.